Greetings everyone. Vanupatra brings to you the news highlights of 27th February 2023. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court has stayed Madhya Pradesh High Court's order which had directed a trial court judge to provide justification for granting bail to an accused and observed that such orders of the High Court seriously affect the independence of the district judiciary in considering bail applications. The court while observing that victim has a fundamental right of fair investigation and fair trial has held that mere filing of the charge sheet and framing of the charges cannot be an impediment in ordering further investigation reinvestigation de novo investigation if the facts so warrant The court has held that conditions under section 45 of Prevention of Money Laundering Act for grant of bail are applicable to anticipatory bail applications under section 438 of Code of Criminal Procedure as well. The court has held that failure to accord sufficient time for an employee to challenge assessment of their performance for a particular year in an annual confidential report before a departmental promotion committee is convened would be treated as non-disclosure of evaluation report. The court has observed that transfer of criminal case from one state to another has to be ordered only in exceptional circumstances as such orders might result in an adverse reflection upon the credibility of the state judiciary and prosecution agency. The court while upholding termination of services of a judicial officer for suppressing the pendency of a criminal case at the time of making application has held that subsequent closure of the criminal case is irrelevant. News highlights from the high courts starting with the Kerala High Court the Kerala High Court has held that there is no embargo on the production of additional documents during a trial if they are essential for arriving at a proper decision trial judge can permit such production based on principles of fair play and good sense The Kerala High Court while issuing directions addressing concerns of pedestrians on roads has observed that lives of citizens particularly pedestrians are in peril every moment and this has to change rapidly lest the next generation will find the city and state to not be capable of being walked upon News highlights from other high courts in the country The Delhi High Court while dismissing various petitions challenging central government's Agnipath scheme has observed that the scheme was made in national interest and to ensure that armed forces are better equipped and the court finds no reason to interfere with the scheme. The Bombay High Court has held that merely because a sarpanch of a village has not performed his statutory duties he cannot be disqualified from the post. This concludes the news for today. Thank you so much.